Reads Across America started its journey to Arlington National Cemetery today. While it may look different this year, the mission still the same. New City Maine's Rosalind Flaherty has more. The journey to honor those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice and their families begins. Their duty was to serve and our duty is to honor. Thousands of Maine made wreaths stop in Portland before making the trek to Arlington National Cemetery, where the graves of fallen soldiers are decorated each December, thanks to wreaths across America. It really does warm your heart in cold conditions to know that people will remember uh, the fallen, their families, and that we can get together and get behind something this important. One of those families is Cindy Tatum's. The knock at the door came on Christmas Day. The Gold Star mother lost her son Daniel in 2007. As you can imagine, uh, Christmas has never been the same for us and our family since that time. This is her first time riding along with the convoy, being named the 2020 Escort Grand Marshal. It's all going to be a wonderful, wonderful um, journey. <laughs> The organization getting a firework send off. As the mission to remember, honor, and teach carries out, even during a pandemic. I encourage people as they go into the holidays and they may not be able to gather with their loved ones to just remember that we're being asked to do something that our military families have been asked to do through the ages. And so we just need to support each other and come together. Rosalind Flaherty, New Center, Maine. The convoy will be abbreviated with the number of people due to the pandemic. The organization says while well, people are encouraged to watch the convoy pass through their state, they're asking people to social distance and the convoy will be streamed virtually. For more information on Wreaths Across America and how you can follow along safely from home, text the word Wreaths to 828-6622. We'll send you a link to our article with the details on the ceremony and safety precautions.